Hello and welcome to American Juniors. My name is Ryan Seacrest. I don't know about you, but I've been missing us. It's been a few weeks since you crowned your American Idol. But we've got something very exciting here in its place. This is a search for a group of super talented young kids. We're looking for a band of five that will end up competing with Ruben and Kelly and others for the top of the charts. This will be huge. Now, this has been done before in the UK, where the band S Club Juniors was a sensation all over Europe. In our nationwide auditions, we've seen cute kids. Hi, my name is Taylor Longbreak, and I'm six years old. Funny kids. She's my wife. <laughs> Dancing kids. Dancing cute, funny kids. A flood of tears and squeals of delight. <laughs> We met embarrassing parents. Oh my gosh. Okay, sing. Pushy parents. This is your chance. Hurry, you hurry, 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 hurry. Right now. Kevin, hurry. No, we okay, that's it. You lost your chance. And stage moms like you wouldn't believe. So when someone great gets up there to sing, they don't pick her. They pick some crappy person. Who goes, oh. But at the heart of it all, we found the best young talent the country has to offer. The mama said you can't hurry in love. No, you'll just have to wait. When will my reflection show who I am inside? Where there is love, I'll be there. This is American Juniors. So here's how it's going to work. From the thousands of auditions, we narrow it down to 20. You pick the best five from that 20. Remember, it's all about great voices, great dancing, and great personalities. Now, to find those personalities, we give them a platform. One chair, one camera, and no parents. I'm going to be in Manga News. I'm going to be a huge star. I think people would like to buy my CD because I'm the second Elvis. Being a pop star is stupid. Stupid. That's why I want to be a SeaWorld trainer, because I really like whales. So, let's begin at 4 a.m. in Pasadena, where thousands of very tired parents lined up the cars and tried to get their kids into the audition. Actually, I should audition. <laughs> We've got a real major problem over here. We are all in line together. People started arguing and fighting in the line. <laughs> we were just, like, sticking Bugs. bumper to bumper, <laughs> because people were just trying to cut in, and we've all been here this long. Let's get along. As day broke, the audition quota filled, and we had to turn cars away. Let's go right out here to the office, just to your left. Thank you. Are you serious? I'm serious. Are you really? Yeah, I'm sorry. After eight hours of waiting, they were not happy. No! Yeah. No! We did. We were here at 4 o'clock. Yeah. No, please don't tell sorry. us yet. No! Tomorrow. Sorry, yeah. for tomorrow, yeah. No! Sorry about that, guys. Just go right up to your left. No! But they still tried to audition. Okay, so they don't even get to try? Right. Okay, sing to them right there, right there. This is your chance. Hurry, you go. hurry, 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 right now. Kevin, hurry. No, okay, we gotta go ahead. You lost your chance. Over 500 kids did get into audition, but it was obvious from the start that they had to impress their own moms as much as the program's producers. Sing it louder. Get me what I start. Louder. Follow me, Okay, no, sing back I think it's very competitive. There's a lot of talent here. A lot of children with very beautiful voices. We've been around singing and competitions and stuff since Amanda was two. And pageants and just, you know, you know the, that there are some parents that are there not for their kids. As a singer, I wish I would have pursued my dreams. And that's why we're here today. My children love to sing because I taught them to sing. I sing in the shower, I sing in the car, I sing karaoke. I love to sing. <laughs> so if that's what the moms were like, what about the dads? Would they be happy to take a back seat? Yeah, right. There's a ribbon in the sky, ribbon in the sky, a ribbon in the sky.
in the sky for love. I know. You know what? He watches me. Ah, uh, it was okay. You're right. So stage dads are just as hard to satisfy. But there was no pleasing Barry Glickman from L.A. Okay, wait, you're going to do, do yours? Okay. Do this for it's wait, wait, do, do that. Uh, I've got to make it real. Uh, tell, them what this, tell them what the song is first. Okay. Do that. Okay. Make it real. Okay. Do it loud. Okay. you just got to make it real. I just hear it. Look at Look the this. camera. They don't have to buy me much. <laughs> if, if they want them, just a house. Coming up, the kids take the stage. We meet Canyon and Jadzia. Plus, we unleash the stage mom from hell. Okay, I'm not a stage mom, but I'm blown away. I, I'm not a stage mom. I don't do that stuff. But I am blown away. With their heads still ringing from their parents' advice, it was time for the juniors to take the stage. They were brought out in groups and asked to sing a verse and chorus and then they were evaluated on their dancing talent. In the audience, who else but the parents? Including the fan club of Kelvin Woods. Hi, my name is Kelvin Woods, and I'm nine years old, and I will be singing Dreams by Ashanti. Dreams are real, and all you have to do is just believe there is nothing. From what it is you want to do You should always go with what you love Don't follow no one else Just Take a look at Kelvin's mom She's feeling it more than he is Tell them dreams are real And all you have to do so Kelvin's folks believed in him, 